Welcome to your daily dose of Danny. And I am so comfortable with being uncomfortable now. And that was so eloquently uh, spoken to me by my business um, coach, my business advisor, uh, Jeffrey Coombs. If you don't know him, check him out. Little shout out there. But it's so true. So when you like move fast and hard, right? And you are one of those people that don't analyze everything. Because there's two types of people. People that analyze and then get stuck. They never do anything other than research and analyze and talk, right? You know that. You know we've been, if you're in that place or you are that style of person, nothing wrong. There's styles, there's pros and cons to everything. And then there are those people that are like shakers and movers. They have an idea, they do it. They learn through doing. They sometimes rush in too fast or they rush in and everything goes great and then situations happen and you have to readjust, right? You have to be able to re adjust. And the shakers and movers can readjust very fast. And people that are analytical and they need lots of information and a lot of data and do a lot of research before they move have a hard time adjusting when life gives you a little like tweak, little hello, this isn't the way you're supposed to be going or hello, you didn't know this was going to happen but it's happening. I happen to be a shaker and mover. I move hard and fast. That's why I have two books that are coming out since May of this year. That's why I have finished the Next Level of You series, actually I'm meeting with you Chad tomorrow, my executive producer, to put that all out there. That's why the Devoted to a Soldier is happening and all of these different events for the documentary. Um, but I move, we move, we move, we move. So sometimes in that you get uncomfortable, stuff comes up and you have to be uncomfortable in this uncomfortableness to move into that next level of you. Because when you're uncomfortable and you're okay with it, you can see yourself for truth. You can see the reality of things. You can be more clear. And then it always helps when you have amazing people that you can message and be like, can I call you? That would have been Joyce today. And get it all out. And then come back into yourself. Because you're also not meant to keep that stuff inside. Hard and fast. That's right, Joyce. And that might have been one of those things that I probably should have thought out before I spoke. But, so my whole um, thing that I'm giving to you, my whole like aha moment within myself is that it's okay if you move fast, right? And it's okay if you're analytical and move slower. But what's not okay is when things happen and things aren't aligning anymore that you stay there out of guilt or anger or questioning or doubt. That is not okay. That needs action. You have to be able to tweak and move. You have to be able to adjust and not see things as a failure. See things as a success. Use everything as a learning experience and change it to make it fit yourself and all parties involved. And there you go. And I gotta tell you, these pants, I'm gonna stand up for a second. Oh, that was loud. These pants, Sheila, thank you so much for sending them to me and having me try them out. I gotta tell you guys, it's like wearing your bed on your body. You are, they are so comfortable.